What is going on, guys? Beretto Live back here. Never heard of Beretto Live. I do WWE and WWE action figures. And today, we have this absolutely amazing video. Uh, I've been thinking about doing this video for a while since I've gotten these two things, but yeah. We have a chair collection video. Nothing compared to the Brandon Hodge. Go subscribe to him. Link in the description. But yeah, uh, we have two chairs here. <laughs> And he might have them, he might not, but yeah. I just wanted to show you my chair collection. There's only two, and you guys can see them right here. And again, never to be alive. I do WWE and WDX shoes, so subscribe down below, and let's get into this video. Okay, so a Clash of Champions chair. Uh, all these are f totally official chairs, so like, I'll, show you the I'll show you the sticker on the bottom to show you that they're official, but yeah. Here's the little back plate, all foam, obviously. In there, uh, you got the WWE logo, and that says Clash of Champions in Gold, with some red background kind of displayed in the black. Uh, this was at um, the Banker's Life Fieldhouse Arena, uh, yeah. and then people used the hashtag WWE Clash, and whatever the heck that says, <laughs> that's so small, and then... WWE Indianapolis, and then it's presented by KFC, and this was dated back September 25th, 2016, so yeah, and on the main, like, sitting part, uh, you got the Universal Championship printed very nicely, uh, you got the little red background, the black little swoosh, not the red little, kind of. Swoosh, but yeah, black it says Universal Champion. Some diamond going around it, and then over here you got the Women's Championship. Uh, this one is just like every title on here is just like your normal Women's Championship. You got like the pinkish kind of swoosh, some diamonds going around it, and then Women's Champion with the WWE logo in there as well. So yeah, pretty cool. Uh, here you got the two. Uh, these don't exist anymore, but yeah, the uh, gold, like the golden tag team championships. Um, yeah, yeah, two gladiator heads, WWE logo, a very nice design going around, and as you can see, there's two of them on top of each other, which is very nice design they added. Uh, it says tag team champions, and yeah, very cool. Uh, yeah, the reason I say they they don't exist anymore is because we have SmackDown tag titles and Raw tag titles that are blue and and red. So yeah, here's the last title and probably my favorite title, uh, the universe. I mean the United States Championship, uh, which is a very savage. Uh, I really want to get this championship in real life, in like the not commemorative but the real championship. I really want to get it, but yeah, I do not have enough money yet. So yeah, support the channel, and you might see a review on that from Davy Shop. But yeah. There's a WWE logo. It says World Wrestling Entertainment, United States Champion. And you got the little nameplate there. I am not gonna write anything there, but yeah. Uh, yeah. So and then you got the flag behind the title, with also the red design, as you guys can see up there. But yeah. If I ever got anybody to sign this, I would have the New Day sign there. And probably Goldberg sign there. Even if they didn't even hold it at the time. Uh, Charlotte would sign there. And AJ Styles would sign there. So yeah, pretty cool. And let's move on to our second chair. In the end, I'll show you that they're all official. And they're all like foldable. And I'll sit on them. And yeah. So here we have the payback chair. Uh, all State Arena, June 1st. Sunday, June 1st, 2014. I don't think this is when they had the WWE Network, to be honest. I don't really, I'm not really sure on that. It says WWE Payback with the big slash in it, which is cool. Again, Sunday, June 1st, 2014. Uh, there, it says it was the, in the Allstate Arena, and it's using the hashtag WWE Payback. And yeah, very nice. And again, this is the padded part as well <clears throat> with the foam inside. Just like the Knight of Champions chair. And here we have the main sitable part. 
is a picture of Triple H, because this is when, oh, sorry, I just hit the chair. Um, I think this is when um, the evolution went up against the shield. And yeah, there's a very nice picture of Triple H. To see, he's got a moody face, he's got a suit on with his signature sledgehammer. And then, of course, it says Triple H right below his sledgehammer. Okay, guys, so now I'm going to fold them up and I'm going to show you guys that they're legit and I'll sit on them for you. Okay, guys, I have the tripod set up. Um, here are the chairs. Uh, yeah, Night of Champions and Payback chair. And I know the collection is kind of small. I'm trying to, like, build up the collection. So, first of all, I'm going to show you guys that they fold up. Uh, and there's the official stickers on there. All official. Um, pretty cool. And they got the studs that hold in the padding. But, yeah, they fold. And I'll show you the other one. Let me just get this thing down. <clears throat> and I really like the spot for them as well in my room, but yeah, here we have the Triple H oh, payback chair, uh, this one's also official, very cool, and then I will sit in both of them for you, okay, bang, okay guys, I'm in the Knight of Champions chair, very comfortable, uh, I got my Shane Mac t-shirt on, and yeah, this is how it would be at like a WWE event, just like cheering on, you know, and then I would scoot over to the payback chair. Here I am at payback. Yes. 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 Okay, guys. So, yeah, this is my uh, WWE chair collection. Um, I know it's not that big, but, yeah, uh, I'm going to be building it up. And when I build it up, I will keep you guys updated if I get another chair or anything like that. So, guys, stay tuned to Burn Alive. Um, yeah, this has been the chair collection. I love you guys. Uh, like, comment, share, subscribe to Brent Alive. And as always, if you don't like WWE, I don't like you.